On this episode of Scott vs. Box, I open up the Megalopolis mystery box sent to me by Megalopolis. Oh, I used to live in Megalopolis for a while, but the rent was just too dang high. Scott vs. Box! This is the Megalopolis City of Collectibles mystery box sent to me by Megalopolis. I don't, I, you know, it's, it could be anything. It could be, it could be, uh, it could be stop signs. It could be, it could be yield signs. I don't know what's in here. But this guy, he's, he's a mystery of himself. He's muscular, he's mysterious, and I gotta find out what's inside. There could be anything in here. So many mysteries. So if you wanna send me anything, the address is below. I'll dedicate a whole video to you. But first, let's do Megalopolis. This could be so many exciting things. Maybe it's my cape. You know, I, I dropped it off at the dry cleaners at Megalopolis and I forgot my ticket. So maybe I found my ticket and finally sent me my cape because I could use that. Oh boy. Oh, there. Oh, we got stuff. We got stuff right away. Get 15 bonus reward points when you share your order. See back for details. Oh, oh, look at that. Post a picture of yourself with your open newly arrived Megalopolis order and tag us. One friend to earn your points. Oh, that's exciting. So they got all the, 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 the Facebook and the Twitter and the Instagram Megalopolis toys. Very cool. Oh, a sticker. Oh, very, very cool right there. And then, oh, another sticker. Overlord approved. That's the Overlord. And then I can also, oh, there's a, I can win free toys. And I got the toy Overlord right away. That's cool. Oh, is he gonna eat them? Don't eat yourself. That's terrible. It's terrible. Your mother should have told you. Never eat yourself. It's terrible. So yeah, more tagging on social media. There's a cat. There's a cat looking at the toy Overlord. Okay, oh. Oh boy, packing peanuts. My favorite. There's stuff here. Whoa, packing peanuts all over the place. Oh, they, well, I'll tell you what, if you are afraid of the Toy Overlord, then this is gonna give you nightmares because the Toy Overlord's everywhere in here. So we got that. So let's see if there's, if there's more in here. Hello, hello. Looking through the packing peanuts, wanna make sure that we don't miss anything. Oh, the Toy Overlord. He sent me packing peanuts. Well, that's not entirely true. There's other stuff in here. I just want to make sure I don't miss nothing. So that seems to be all that there. Now I'm covered in packing peanuts. They're like bath salts, right? I can use those. So let's see what we got here. What is this mystery item? Whoa, whoa, holy smokes. Look at this, it's a walking dead. Daryl, save your prisoner. So dreamy, even when he's dirtier and in prison. And he's got a dirty mop, oh man. Is there any stop in this guy? So it says walking down on the back. Uh, and then, yeah, just uh, made by McFarlane Toys. Man, they good. They make good quality stuff. So let's open up the Savior Prisoner Daryl. Oh, what a dream boat. If only he had a horse. If only. So let's get this open here. Huh? That's cool. This is way cool. Man, Toy Overlord. He knows. He knows how to read my book, if you know what I'm saying. Walking Dead McFarland toys? Yes and yes, please. All right, let's get this open, huh? Let's get this out of the box, y'all. Huh? All right, ah, there we go. Okay. Man, these McFarland toys, they have such amazing detail. It's like they really do hold these people prisoner and they go, we're, we're gonna sculpt you, all right? You have to stay here for four days while we perfectly sculpt your face and your knees. Very good at the knees. Have you noticed that? They're great at knees. Take a McFarlane toy, check out the knees. Excellent, excellent, I tell you. All right, I get that and cut out all the, the ties there. Oh, I don't wanna mess up your hair more than it's already messed up, prisoner. And then uh, I'm excited for this McFarlane toys mop myself. That's what Spawn needed. Look at that mop, that's a good mop, all right? That's a great mop. Oh man, he's like a toxic Avenger. Look at this, look at this. Look at all the detail. Look at the big old A on him because he did very well in school. And then he's got a dirty neck. And uh, yeah, he just looks surly and upset. So he's got that big thing in the back. But look at this, look at this mop holding action. Both hands. You can put it in either hand. He's an ambidextrous mop holder. Look at that. Amazing. Oh, the wrist is a little loose. And uh, well, this mop is very heavy to be fair. It's a very heavy mop. Uh, and Daryl, you know, he's proficient holding crossbows, not mops. There we go. Oh, that's a good mop holding hand right there. He's got his little shoes. He's got a little platform. You can put them on. This is so exciting. This is so exciting. This is the best part of my day, everybody. 
holding Savior Prisoner Daryl with Mop. I don't know why they didn't put Mop first. Go, uh, McFarlane Toys, Mop with uh, Daryl action figure, whatever, who cares? But the Mop is there. That's great. That's going on the mantle. Oh, he fell down. All right, well, let's take a look at this. The Megalopolis, the Toy Overlord. So it looks uh, very similar to a, uh, like a Lego figure. Oh, and it's got the website on the back there, megalopolis.toys. And there he is. Oh, man, he's ripped. I didn't notice how ripped he is. He's got all, he's got like 11 teen abs. It's crazy. So we got that. Oh, and there's a little, I don't think it's quite a plush. What would you, what is this? Let me feel the texture here. Oh, it's uh, like a spongy, squishy type thing. So you got the uh, toy overlord right there as well. Very cool. And put that to the side. And then we got something else here. What's this? What's this other thing? Whoa, more walking dead. Uh-oh. <laughs> These two are together. Well, that never turns out well. Spoilers. Spoilers. Uh, walking Dead AMC Negan and Glenn Deluxe Box Set. Well, uh, looks like everybody has their heads, so that's cool. Let's see what we've got on the back here. Glenn, Daryl, Rick, Michonne. Five inch figures, uh, seven inch figures, all these different collectibles here, all available here. No mops. <laughs> Don't want none of those. Well, maybe a Michonne, because she got swords. So let's pop this open. And here, where's a, where's a good pop open spot? Somewhere. Give me the good, with the, this is a bit, how you, how you open? Oh, there we go. Nope. Yep. Oh, that's the tricky part about these things. You gotta figure out where the, where the good opening spot is. All right, there we go. Just open that. All right, there. Yeah, more McFarland toys. Man, they're sending top of the line stuff here. McFarland toys ain't messing around. They, they're premium. They're premium. So let's take a look at this deluxe box set. What all we got here? We got goodies galore. Oh boy, we got pavement. We got pavement. Very exciting. And then, so let's check out, oh, Negan, you so bad. Such an evil, evil, evil man. Uh, all right, and cut these out. Got these little, there we go, little protectors in here so the figures don't get messed up. Always appreciate that. There's Negan, there's Glenn. Uh, and we got weapons for days. Oh, so we got a, we got a machining gun. We've got a pistol. Get that, uh, tape covering up all these. Well, I'll get these out. Oh, is that a grenade? What is that? Is that a hat? It's very hard to tell in the plastic. Let me get this out of here. Oh, what has been your favorite season of The Walking Dead? You tell me. Is it the most recent one? Is it the first season? You know, I'm really partial to the first season. I, I'm enjoying everything else, but, and that first season was something else. Oh, I dropped another gun. That's Glenn's gun. And then another pistol. And then uh, also, who's your favorite Walking Dead character? I gotta think, you know, I do like me some Michonne. I do like me some Rick. I do like some of those, some of those classic Carl. Carl's great. How do I get those pistols? These are so, it's good. It's in there. I just gotta get it out of here. Can't find where the tape starts and ends. Just get it out of there. Uh, yeah, who's your favorite Walking Dead character? Oh, is it one of the zombies? Who's your favorite zombie? Who's your favorite zombie? What's their name? Zombie gal, zombie on a bicycle that's only a spine. She was great, am I right? She needs to come back. What's she up to? Where's her character arc? All right, let's get this. This is awesome. It's, I gotta get these little things. I gotta get this chain. Oh, got it. Got the chain. Oh, there we go. And then this one pesky pistol that's a little eluding me. Give it. Give me the gun. I almost got it. I got it. Uh, and there's Lucille as well, the baseball bat. Awesome. Look at all the little things that I'm gonna lose right away. Very cool. So then we've got a different Negan hand. How do you, I, I'm guessing, let me see. Ah, I ripped his hand off. So there's that, but then I guess this is a different hand that I can push on here, or I've just ripped his hand off unnecessarily. I hope I didn't. No, that goes on. No problem. <laughs> yes, sir. Yep, like a glove. Not really. Yeah, all right. So we got that there. And then you can put the machine gun around his neck. And then you can put a, a pistol in his hand. Just shove that. Oh, man, his hand is bloody. 
Oh, that's a bloody hand. Well, all right. So yeah, he's covered in blood right there. Ah, uh, yeah, you may want to be 12 years and up, as it suggests on there, to hold all this. And then you got Negan covered in barbed wire on that. And then just, all right. And that, well, you know what? Let's change things around. Let's turn the tables. Let's give Glenn the old bet and see how Negan likes it. Here we go. Yeah, but just put that in your hand. Just put it, there we go. Holding it like a real pro. <laughs> no problem there. Just, uh, you may want to get a better grip on that. No, okay. So we'll put that there. And then he's like, hey, I didn't like what you did to me. So, wham. Oh, Negan goes down. Hey, lost a hand via the baseball bat. Oh, and now Glenn's got guns. Go gun Glenn. Yep, and put a gun there. Oh, you can put a gun. He's got a little holster right here, too. Super cool. Put him up right there. Oh, he dropped the other gun. All right, well, oh, oh, oh Butterfingers Glenn. Man, they sent me some cool stuff, old Megalopolis. This mystery box. This is very cool stuff. You sign up for your own Megalopolis box. You get cool stuff like this from McFarland Toys. Who knows what else it could be in there? All sorts of neat stuff. There you have it. Megalopolis mystery box filled with walking dead cool stuff. Whew, that was epic, like all my unboxings. So to be sure to subscribe by clicking right up here, and then also you can watch more Scott vs. Box videos by clicking right over here. And join the notification squad by clicking on that bell, then you'll know when every unboxing comes. <sighs> Time to do aerobics.